absolutely ridiculous. There's bloody plants everywhere. I should just rip out the whole lot by myself. Huh? What do you think about that? Mum! Yeah, exactly. have any gardening tools, do you? Oh, amazing. Yes, yeah, some shears, just anything to help me get started. Oh, you're such a sweetheart. Yeah, look, I'll be right over. What have you done? I made, I made Bonnie a new home. But where is he, sweetheart? He's asleep. Oh, gosh. Oh. It's not your fault, sweetheart. I don't think he would have made it anyway. Welcome to the office. This is where all the hard work happens. <laughs> Could you tell us about the pictures? Oh, yes, yes. Uh, well, here we have our first ever female Santa, Lorraine Briggs. What a woman she was. And this one? Oh, oh. He seems awfully short. Yes, yes. Warren was of smaller stature, yes. You know, little people are so often underestimated for their strength. But like I always said to Warren, good things come in small packages. Why did you start going to school? Ah, well, uh, well, well, the truth of the matter is that Santa School has its roots. It, it was birthed from a, a very traumatic childhood memory of mine. <laughs> it was Christmas Eve and I was eight years old. I left some cookies out for Santa and Rudolph like I did every year. And went to bed. But I must have been very excited because I woke up in the night. And so I thought I'd go to the living room and, and see if Santa had come. I, I've never been able to stomach a carrot, no, not even in coal, so I have to pick out the little bits. And... Hello everyone and welcome to Santa School! Just before we get started, I'd like to take a quick long call. Good, great. And now to the most exciting part of our day, we've got time to try out our costumes! 